and I come the sun for this for the re re uh, rehabilitation of the government of money. This is a $68 million project, hugely funded by Badia with $65 million. And the government of Sierra Leone contributed a counterpart funding of $3 million, of which $1.3 million has already been disbursed according to the finance ministry. And the $1.7 million will soon be disbursed. However, Implementation of the education sector support project in Bo and Kenema had been halted for five years due to challenges with procurement and the bidding process. After successfully convincing Badia to refund the project, President Bio, now a former supervisor of the project, congratulated Harris Construction Company for winning the bid. He also reiterated the importance of quality work particularly at his alma mater. Harris, good, this a good project, but a trouble project. <laughs> Harris, this is a good project, but it could have trouble because we will not tolerate bad work here. If you want to be blacklisted and never work in this country again, then cut corners on this job. Congratulations on securing this contract, but the quality of your work on this project will determine your future opportunities here. <laughs> this is an old school that requires thorough refurbishment. We are not just rehabilitating, we are also building new structures to expand the school because the number of pupils has exceeded its capacity. Students are doubling up in beds in the dormitories and that is unacceptable. Bow School Principal Edward Mustafa Baka discusses the specifics of the rehabilitation and expansion efforts. A new two story fifteen classrooms block with toilet facilities, office spaces and disabled facilities. Two new staff quarters, a two story building consisting of six apartments, and another which will be a single story made up of four apartments. Six new toilets and a new dormitory. Minister of Basic and Senior Secondary Education, Conrad Saki, highlights how the project will enable more students to benefit from the Free Quality Education Initiative. He also elaborates on the additional benefits of the new facilities, positioning the school as a center of excellence for quality education. Providing an environment that fosters creativity, innovation, and academic achievement. It will be a space where our young learners can fly, explore their interests, and develop their skills necessary to navigate the ever-changing world. President Bio toured the construction site within the school compound. According to Harris Construction Company, the project is expected to be completed within a year. Salifuchar Nakamura, AYV News.